Hello, good evening. Hi, Jonel. Hello, Isaura. Hello, teacher. I'm sorry for being late, guys. Lo siento que siempre me agarra la tarde con, con la otra clase. Y bueno, lo siento hacerlas esperar, de verdad. I'm sorry. A veces ni me doy cuenta que ya son las nueve y uno. Y así como que, oh my God, vea. Si no me avisan, ahí sigo en la clase, imagínense. Sorry, guys. Sorry, 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 sorry. You don't deserve it. You say uh, you're, you're waiting for me and it's not fair, but sorry, guys. I need to put an alarm. Y hasta incluso me sale la alarmita ahí que tengo la otra clase y aún así, fine. Uh, soy despistada. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, sometimes I, I am very like, like, excited about the class and I and I forget that I have another class. I'm so sorry about it. So thank you for being on time, guys. Um I think I mentioned you I mentioned yesterday that you can have extra material. If you want to have more practice, you can have extra material where? I think I showed you, right? Ok, where, manual del participante, ok, aquí. Uh -huh. Intermediate 2. ¿Ya? Sí, ya, ya lo habían visto, ¿verdad? Ahí tiene, tiene un poquito más de ejercicios para, para practicar un poquito más. But I don't know why I cannot see it very well. Ahorita si no lo alcanzo, no se ve nada. Sorry. Hmm. Anyways, we're going to start the section number. Number three. Three. Yeah. Number three. And what is this section about? Vamos a ver who, who saw videos already. Evelyn and Renato, what happened to your camera? Yesterday, no me lo encendieron tampoco. Uh -huh. Section Three. Buenas noches, teacher. Sí, el daño a mi cámara es permanente por mi hijo de tres años. Mi teléfono cayó varias veces. Ay, es cierto, ¿verdad? Siempre se le... Oh Pero ahí estamos God. participando. <laughs> excellent, excellent, excellent. All right. And Evelyn, what happens? También. Ahí está. Buenas noches, teacher. Sí, igual ya lo había comentado. De lo vasco, ¿verdad? Es que nunca la conocemos, Evelyn, qué barbaridad. <risa> sí, gracias, teacher. Ok, vaya, pero ya estamos. Lo bueno es que estamos en la clase, ¿verdad? Sí estamos participando, poniendo atención, so that's good, all right? Thank you, guys, for reminding me. Gracias por recordarme, ¿verdad? De lo que pasa. Ok, so in this class you will learn vocabulary Be for sure. discussion celebration. Yes, hello. Be sure. Yes. No, happy sorry. birthday, happy birthday to you. Yeah. I was, I was thinking about your birthday all day. Thank you. Why didn't you send me a, a, a direct message? <laughs> um, because I think that you can answer uh, uh, an unknown number songs. And uh, I know. But but it's okay for probably, me. Probably probably not. Yeah, sometimes I don't. But uh, if is if you say. Hey, teacher, congratulations. I know it's one of my students. Sometimes if um, if you say just, hey, teacher, I have this question. And sometimes they uh, some students tell me, teacher, I'm sorry, I'm not going to be in the class because I have this and that. And I say, okay, but who are you, <laughs> right? Who's this? Congratulations once so, again. Thank you. Say. I'm 39 years old already, guys. Ya, 40, 45. <laughs> almost 40, almost, almost 40. 40. That's right. Yeah. Uh, anyways, but I've been I've been very happy that I have received a lot of congratulations and appreciate it, Nazario that you Wonderful. remember. Yeah. You're welcome to show. Remember. All right. Thank you, guys. Yeah. Hey, everybody, let's read. In this class, you will learn vocabulary for discussing celebration. Come on. Do you see? Yes. 
Read, everybody. In this class, you will learn vocabulary for discussing celebration. You are right. Lean, pues. In this In class, this you will class learn class vocabulary class for discussing celebration. Vocabulary. Celebration. celebration. All right. Celebration. 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 Turn. Turn. Vocabulary. Vocabulary. Is that? All right. Yes. You will learn. Right. This. Learn. You will learn. 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 Hello. Good evening. Good evening, guys. Okay. Hello. Nice. So let's celebrate the vocabulary. We are going to use the vocabulary and then you will read the vocabulary and pay attention on the pronunciation, please. Okay. Anniversary, cake, cards. I can hear you. We miss the audio tissue. We Thank lost. you. Very good. Sorry, guys. Remember, you may listen to the audio program. Oh, Hi, yes. are you ready to begin? I want you to follow me and repeat the words as they appear in your screen. Anniversary. Cake. Cards. Cake. Cards. Dancing. Dancing. Fireworks. Fireworks. Flowers. Flowers. Fruit punch. Fruit parade. Punch. Presents. Presents. Turkey. Wedding. Turkey's wedding. Very good. Remember, you may listen to the audio program as many times as you need to. Cards. Right. Dancing. What I, need, what I need from you right now is to uh, talk about celebration, of course. Uh, we can talk about any celebration. We can talk about celebration for birthdays, for um, uh, what is it like bachelor, um, weddings. What else? Baptize, baptize. Anyways, maybe just uh, funerals for a few years. <laughs> Those are not celebrations. Ay, Nazari, sí. Sale con alguna cosa ahí. Okay. So. It's not, it's not me, teacher. It's not me. It was not you? No. Who said that? I don't know. Who said funeral? It's your friend. <laughs> it was me, se dice. It was me, teacher. Okay, guys. Example. I will give you my example. And um, I, I need you to please put them in context as well. Example. Okay, you look, uh, um, the anniversaries are always nice. Uh, people have, uh, well, people celebrate uh, anniversaries when they have, for example, um, uh, they have a year or two years or whatever amount of years to uh, that they have that a couple has been have has been together, and normally in a celebration they have a cake. Um, they sometimes play with cards or they send the cards for invitation sometimes uh, people like uh people like dancing a lot especially cumbias in some some celebrations or some birthday parties it's very common to dance uh cumbias some people um if if there there are people who like to uh, pop fireworks in the morning to wake up the the birthday girl or the birthday the birthday person. Uh, some people also send flowers to the birthday girl or the or the person who has the birthday or celebrating birthday. And some people as well try to well they sometimes drink beer. They sometimes drink uh alcohol whatever wine or champagne or whiskey vodka rum or etc but in some cases they 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 have fruit punch which is delicious but if you drink a lot you will get really drunk all right and also for universities in here in suchitoto we will have um the uh we have a parade 
um, on July then the 15th because it's the anniversary of the town, of the city. The city, Suchitoto city, this coming Saturday. But by the way, this is true. This is true. Okay. Uh, so they have a party. Uh, we have the parade, as I mentioned. And what I love the most when I receive is when I receive presents, right? When it's it, because of my birthday, I receive presents, which is really good. And um, yeah, that's it. Yeah, creo que ocupé casi todos. Rose turkey, I don't know when. Oh, yes, Rebecca. What do you do to celebrate your birthday? My mom was sick, so she's the only one who prepares something to... Delicious food? Something, yeah, something good. So like like hen soup, the gallina, sopa de gallina. But she's a little sick and she said, okay, we're going to celebrate it later. We're going to eat in a restaurant some maybe. But it was not special. I mean... Just the congratulations, but no, I didn't do anything, anything special today. Maybe on weekend, teachers. On weekend, we will have a lunch maybe or a dinner because they actually wanted to... We are invited. We... <laughs> of course you are, but, but most of the time we go to either San, San Salvador by Ilopango because it's closer. Or eh, Aguilares. <laughs> and you live very far away, Rebecca. Look, um, oh no, they wanted to have a uh, dinner tonight, but guess what? After I have, class. I had to work. <laughs> nah, that's right. Yeah, so I couldn't I couldn't go. So we will do it for this coming Saturday because I will work on on Friday as well. Todos esos días nos toca de corrido. So, anyways, guys, yeah. yeah. So um, yeah, on Friday we will have some something to eat. That's it. But she gave me she gave me some some money. Instead of preparing the, <laughs> instead Wonderful. of preparing, yeah, instead of preparing food, she gave me like, okay, go and, and eat something. And I was, okay, nice. And my, one, some of my cousins gave me like some like very nice blouses, etc. They they gave me different, different things. So I, I enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. Anyways, guys, um, I need you to please tell me what a celebration is and what do you normally do in a celebration, either for birthday party, for anniversary, for weddings, or uh, for funerals, of course. It's not a celebration, but we can say, uh, we can talk about funerals. Just put this vocabulary in context, okay? Any, any word or any vocabulary you don't know the meaning, guys? No? no one, teacher. Okay. No one. Any, nobody has a question with the vocabulary, guys? No? What means parade? A parade, all right. For example, on September the 15th, they do parades. They, they, they march, so those are parades. Mm -hmm. Got it? Okay. You. Yeah. Uh, any other? Yeah. Basically, that's the the only kind of weird word, maybe. And the rest are very very common. Okay. Who wants to help me uh, using the vocabulary, guys? Three, uh, at least three vocabularies. So how to use them in context. I know you know the meaning. I know what the meaning is, but put it in context. Uh-huh. So for example, you could say, okay, uh, for my birthday party, I like to receive presents, 
and I like to have a patty sometimes. I like to receive flowers, and etc. What can you tell me? How do you like the celebrations? Or how do you celebrate your birthday or wedding? Well, wedding? In the case that you are, are, are married, of course. Who's married here? Evelia. Isaura. Okay. Isaura. Are you the mm -hmm. only the only married here? David? Are you married? No, I'm not married. I just um my friend. Free relation. Just a free relation, maybe? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> no problem. Tell me about your your wedding, Isaura. When was it? How long was it ago? How long ago was it? And what did you do for your wedding? My wedding was is it very stressful? It was and, stressful. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Why? It was a matter. Yes, and when I prepare uh the everything prepared prepare uh huh always fight fighting with my husband <laughs> 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 and I have twelve years ago married. Oh, okay. I have 12 years uh, of marriage, you can say, or I have been married for 12 years. He estado casada. I have been married, wow, 12 years? It's a lot. I actually yeah. never got married. I just live as, as David said, <laughs> it's in a free relation. And I just tolerate, I could stand only five years and that's it. Not any, not, no more, no more. Uh huh, Nazario. But you're, 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 you're. Are you in a relation, relation as well? Yeah, yeah, yes. Uh, I'm, and I live so happily. Okay. I think so. Um, and I was watching. Sing. Oh, oh I was watching. Peco, the, peco the de world. eso me dice. I sing. I was think, watching. I think. No, I was watching. Okay. I was watching the the vocabulary on my screen, and I think that I enjoyed at least maybe four or or five different kind of thing that I made with my wife in our anniversary. Okay. For example, sometime, sometimes. Uh, a veces, sometimes. Sometimes. Sometimes we we go, go out and okay. take uh, or eat a uh, a good food. Okay. Uh, she she loves cakes. My wife loves cakes, so I have to buy uh, in every anniversary a cake for us. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't like to go down since. No, you don't. I don't like not, it. No, your not even your wife. No, because okay. she like to go to the church, so oh, she, got yeah, it, got it. She don't like to dance, but she loves she la, she doesn't she love flowers, for example. Sometimes I have to buy at least three or four times a, a, a year because it's not only for the anniversary. Four I times have, a year, okay. Yeah, uh, for example, I bought flower or I buy flowers. Uh, in, in her birthday. Okay. Yeah. Uh, in the anniversary. Uh, and sometimes in another uh, times of uh, not common days, for example. Oh, okay. It's better, yeah. right? Not not like yeah. in special days, I guess. That it's good that you can give like a one like one flower, like. Out of the blue, right? Without something like very special. No, I mean, you can give a flower 
uh, unexpected, right? If there is not like we something, have living. something special to to give a to be to give a flower, it's better if you give yeah. a flower without having a special reason. Yeah, and when uh, sometimes suddenly I uh, appear in my house oh, with, a, romantic. with ro rose with rose ah. of another kind of flowers. Hey, that's good. I thought you were you were not that that romantic. <laughs> uh, not how ever. long? How at long least, have you been least... with the relation? How long? Oh, uh, we have been at least twenty three years. Wow. Yeah. So is, is, is my she... daughter? My first daughter is twenty one and oh. just close twenty two. Is this so? It's the only relationship you have had. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Twenty three years is a lot. Yeah. All right. What um, about Natalie? What do you think, Natalie? I'm Tell crazy. Me. A little Try. bit. <laughs> <laughs> You're a little crazy. Yeah. Okay. Mm, I don't. I don't know, but Tell me, Natalie. Remember to use a little bit of this uh, vocabulary, please. Tell me. Um. Almost always, my I celebrate my birthday with Birth. my fam Birth. birthday 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 yeah. with my family. Yes, and we go out to the dinner. Okay, and with my friends, uh, we go out maybe uh, to the beach and oh, dance. That's good. And this. Yes. You like go to you like going to the disco. You like dancing. Yes, I like. <laughs> All right, that's nice. I used to go dancing for my birthday, but long time ago. Now I live in Suchitoto. This is death. After ten p.m., everything is closed here, so it's boring, super boring. That's something that I miss, like the 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 um, uh like the lifetime um I mean the um, nightlife in 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 San Salvador here in Suchitoto everything is closed so it's a little boring too, yeah Rebecca I know imagine we cannot celebrate anything imagine nah. anyways um what about uh, tell us about uh about the feeling Rebecca what do you normally do uh, I know that most of most of you are are single so Tell me, what do you normally do for uh, for your birthday? Well, in my birthday, always I'm working because <laughs> because uh, I live I live to the frontier. Frontier, the frontier. Yeah, a border, frontier or border. You can say border, border or from frontier, 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 and. Uh, every year, my birthday, uh, guy, the same, the same day. <laughs> oh, the is the 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 day that you have to work, you have it, It's your it's your birthday. Yes, and my coworkers uh, give me a cake. Um, okay, and it's a boring. It's a, a little day. boring, yeah, I know, yeah. I know. Working in your birthday is not like super nice, right? Yeah. Okay. Anyways, yeah. job is job, right? And yeah. so do you live with your parents, Rebecca, or by yourself? No, I live with my partner. Just with your partner. So your yeah. family is here in San Salvador? Yes. I say here and I'm not I'm not there. Okay. <laughs> well, anyways, um thank you for sharing that. I, I'm sorry to hear that your birthday is a little boring. I know, yeah. I know the feeling. I know the feeling. Hairo, what about you? Are you married? Have you celebrated your an uh, any anniversary? Or are you single? Yes. Tell I me. Like... Yeah, I am here. I would like is talk about presents. For example, in the celebration when I I am I am a birthday, I am received presents from my friends, from my family, for example, in cards. Okay. They gift they cards. Give me 
some presents, for example, gift cards. Yeah, mm -hmm. gift cards. Thanks. They give me a uh, fruit. Yeah. Okay. I, um, uh, we come to party on the beach for beach. Wow. Yeah. That's uh, nice. On, on December, on December thirty one. The thirty first is your is uh, your birthday on the thirty first. No, the, oh no, no. You're no, just talking and, about Chris uh like a uh, New Year's Eve. Yeah. Okay. That is oh. Okay. You say para mi cumpleaños, you say on my birthday, I I celebrated uh -huh, in the beach or at the beach, and I received presents from my family, etc. Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you, Jairo. Thank, Let thank, me thank. see um, David. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Well, well in my case, um, uh, I don't like um, uh, people that tell me, tells me, happy birthday. I, I'm no, not really? waiting for that. I, I'm not waiting for that date. But, um, yeah, there are people around me uh, always say, hey, baby, happy birthday. Sometimes they give me some presents. A hug, it's, it's okay. Um, okay. Last, uh, my birthday is in November, and last year I had a terrible day. <laughs> before oh, my birthday. sorry. It was it was on weekday, but in in Sunday, on Sunday, on Sunday, mm -hmm. yes, on Sunday, um, I grabbed my skateboard and I went to the park. There's a park near my house. And I went very early. I I woke up, I had breakfast, and I went to the park to skateboarding. But when I arrived home, I I arrived um around eleven a.m. Mm -hmm. and and my family and my neighbors were waiting for me. And they said, surprise! <laughs> they were waiting waiting for me with a lunch. And oh. presents. They were all together and That's they good. put a banner with happy birthday, David. It was amazing. I was so so glad in that. Okay. Today. Well, a surprise party are are always really, really nice, of course. You don't yes. expect it? Uh-huh. It right. <laughs> with that surprise. It was very crazy. <laughs> Excellent. Okay. So you don't have you say I had a terrible birthday. You said, why? Yes, because um at work I had problems with my boss with some workers. Mm -hmm. uh, it's something usual in nowadays. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, try not to get uh something personal. Just try to do your job and that's it. Try to um. Ignore, you know, sometimes, you know, bosses are kind of bossy <laughs> or too demanding, yes. right? Yeah, yes. I know. Um, yes, my birthday, I was Fortunately, upset all day. Uh, sorry. Uh, Sunday, uh, my family and neighbors, uh, they broke my, uh, my back to my, to my face. Yeah, that's good. That was good. At least something good happens later. All right, hey, what happened? Hey, Francisco, tell us about your uh, any celebration that you like to talk about. Uh, okay, um, my case, um, on my birthday, Bird? I like celebrate birthday. birthday. Mm -hmm. I like celebrate to get up early and go cycling. And then to go, go to the beach, uh, have a dinner with my daughters mm -hmm. mm, and then go to a bar and celebrate all night wow uh, yeah dancing dancing songs okay. everything singing uh, do you sing sing yeah i like but i'm not good but i like <laughs> yeah, you're not good uh, at singing Okay. Yeah, but in the last two years I have been uh, able to go to celebrate in Mexico. Uh, really? 
Yeah, we have a party in Cancun. Wow. Yeah. Excellent. Congratulations then. Invite us. Uh, Rebecca, so we can we can go to Mexico if you go if, <laughs> if you invite us. <laughs> hey, nice. That that was great. Wow. It's good that you can travel. Okay. I I was supposed to travel to Mexico, but they denied a visa to me. Pinches mexicanos. Pinches. <laughs> Pinches mexicanos. All right. Yeah, se creen más gringos que, que los americanos, vean. O más americanos que los gringos, no sé. I don't know. But anyways, it's Mexico so beautiful. I don't know yet. And I wish I know. Uh, I know this country. Um, anyways, thank you for sharing that. Uh, the, the, your experience. What about Glendy? How are you, Glendy? A little bit sick. Uh, are you able to talk or you you prefer not to say anything? <laughs> uh, yeah. Tell me, how do you celebrate your birthday? Uh, I celebrate my birthday on December. Uh, December is one of my favorite month. Mm -hmm. Especially I because I celebrate Christmas, yeah. Yeah. birthday, and New Year. Uh, okay. I receive a present and mm -hmm. I like to spend time with my family, also with my friends. And I usually do something with them. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. Hey guys, when you say my my birthday is in December, in July, you say in when you say on is when you mention the complete date. Example, my birthday is on July 11. Or you say um, in July. Solo el mes, in. Si digo la fecha completa, digo on. Okay? Nice. What about uh, uh, Evelyn? Are you there? Uh, yes, it's here. Estoy. <laughs> In English, we did practice English. How do you okay. celebrate your birthday? Remember, guys, not many of you, casi nadie ha ocupado el, el vocabulario que estábamos viendo. Uh -huh. Okay, I remember my birthday. I was always working. Um, working? I Working. I remember... Uh, I remember I has, I has been, um, he estado es, I have been, I have been, I, ha, I have been, um, eh, uh, ¿cómo sería? Eh, I, I won't remember, I, I, I won't remember, eh, Quiero recordar, I want to remember, I want to remember. I want to remember, eh, ¿cómo sería una vez? Once, once. Una vez. How do you say once. una vez? Se escribe once. once. Ah, o sea, once. puede decir one time o puede decir once. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Once, eh, I, eh, I was, I was, I was busy beach in my birthday. I visited the beach. We fui a, oh, I went I, to the beach. Fui a la playa. I visited the beach. Uh, I I was remember uh, in incredible uh, because uh, I, I I was go with my friends i was a uh, go my family okay uh, thank you thank uh, you thank you le voy a uh, le voy a interrumpir porque me está ocupando uh, mucho was y estamos hablando de que yo fui con mi familia uh, no recuerdo es simplemente i remember estaba uh, recordando si quiero decir i was remembering no es muy común uh, simplemente ocupo el pasado tenemos que practicar más los pasados. 
I remembered, okay. I visited, I went, I had. Ok, tenemos que practicar un poquito más los verbos en pasado. Ok, ah, ya yeah, Evelyn. Uh, finally, okay. Renato. Tell me about your celebration or are you married? Have you celebrated any wedding uh, uh, yet? Yes, yes. Uh, on my birthday, my wife prepared roast beef and ribs for me because it's my okay. favorite food. Okay. Uh, she buys me a cake and give it a present. Mm -hmm. And the children have cards. Okay. Usually, usually my birthdays are at home and the following weekend we go out as family to visit some new or fun place. Okay. Nice. Thank you guys. Fireworks. So Flowers. Ahí está. Fruit punch. Parade. Eh, vocabulary, guys. Let's do, let's continue. By the end of the class, you will, by the end of this class, you will understand the use of relative clause of time. ¿Cuáles vimos la, al inicio los relative clauses, guys? No fue con ustedes que vimos eso, ¿verdad? Bueno, tenemos relative clauses que es cuando estamos dando un poco más de información. Example. Ha, huh. Francisco is a guy who celebrates his birthday traveling to the beach. We're going to a pub. Pub, it's a bar. Okay. Pub or bar. Who. Sí. Digo, Francisco es alguien que. Uh, who. Ahí digo who. Pero tenemos el de time. De que, ¿Cuál creen que es? El del time. When? When, exactly. For example, hmm, Christmas, it's a time of, uh, I mean, I mean, December is the best month because it is when people celebrate Christmas and celebrate the um, um, Christmas Eve, I mean, New Year's Eve, there is when. Ahí estamos ocupando un relative clause. Simplemente ocupamos el relative clause para dar explicación adicional de algo, ¿ok? Let's watch the video and then we can see... Um... Hello, before you watch the video, I want you to know what a relative clause is, so pay attention. A relative clause is used to define or identify the noun that precedes them. In this case, we will talk about the relative pronoun when, because we want to talk about time. Okay. Let's see the number 3.4. Instructions. Um, help me, David. Instructions. How much do you know about these days and months? Read the sentences and complete them by choosing the best information. Good job. Best information. So, New Year's Day is a day when... People have parties with family and friends. Mm -hmm. Number two, please help me... Isaura, number two. April Fool's Day is a day when... People sometimes play tricks on friends. Yeah. April's Fool's Day. Fool's Day. All right. Number three, help me, Natalie. May and June are the months June. when... June. May and June. May and June. May and June are the months when... Month. 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 Uh -huh. Month. When? May and June. I don't know. <laughs> what do you think, guys? Many, many young adults many choose, young to, adult get choose to get married. 
Okay. Many young adults choose to get married. I didn't know. No sé por qué. Siento que me hace falta algo. Porque eso, las respuestas es, no, tendría que tener algo en, en, tendríamos que haber leído algo para saber esas respuestas, pero ni modo, ¿verdad? lo vamos a hacer así porque no, no se ve nada, o oh, sí. Es que el video estaba como cortado. Uh -huh, eso veo. Yes, David. The instruction says. How much do you know about these days? Mm-hmm. Okay. Ah, ya está, ¿verdad? It's about knowledge. Ah, oh, okay. Anyways, we're learning. April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. ¿Por qué quieren tener hijos en diciembre, quizás? I don't know. Anyways, Valentine's Day is a day when... Help me, Francisco. What's number, teacher? Um, uh, number four. Okay, number four, Valentine's Day is a day when people express their their love to someone. Yeah, Valentine's, very good. Thank you, Valentine's Day. Ana Silvia, hello, how are you? Tell me the number five. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Um, what's what's uh, what's number? Come on, Ana Silvia. Se acaba de the de, five, de... five. Ah, oh, es que on. estaba todavía en las anteriores. Estaba pre preguntando si era la cinco. The five. Number five. Uh, yes. The Labor Day is Labor. Day when Labor. Labor. Labor Day is a day when. People have honor workers. People uh -huh. in many countries honor workers. Yeah, thank you. And number six, um, Jonel. Um, February is the month when? Fe guys? The same like January, February, February, February. February. Everybody repeat February. 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 La R no se pronuncia. Se lo voy a poner para que vean. Para que no me, no me crean a mí, sino que escuchen acá. No se pronuncia la R, fíjense. Oiga. February. Yeah. February. 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 Vaya, ahí está. Y el otro. January, dicen otros. January. January. Okay. January. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So. So it's a month when. The month when. Okay. Brazilians celebrate carnival. Okay. We did I didn't know either, but we have well we we have something new to learn. Okay. The next help me read Hyro. This these instructions, okay. In this class, yes, yes. In this class, okay, lesson objective. So yes, in this class, you will listen to an audio about a carnival. This will help you develop 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 a skill in listening. Sorry. In listening for specific yeah, yeah, information. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In listening for a specific information. Yep. Okay. One more time. Aquí decimos develop skill. Develop what? skills here. Develop skills. Yeah, good job. Aquí, yeah. acuérdese que no tenemos una E, solo dice develop skills. 
no decimos develop, develop eh, sí, develop solamente skills. develop skills in listening. Develop skills in listening. Everybody, develop skills in listening. Hacemos un puente entre todas esas palabras. Develop skills in listening. Come on. Develop skills in listening. Develop skills in listening. Develop skills in listening. Skills in, skills, skills in, in, todos juntos. Ok, aquí también podría decir to an audio, an audio, an audio. You will listen to an audio, an audio, an audio, an audio about, 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 ok. Ya, otra vez, in this class you will listen to an audio about our carnival. This will help you develop skills in listening for specific information. A specific. Specific information. If, aha, la C la pongo con la I, miren. Specific information. Good. Thank you. So, listen to the audio and answer the following questions. Type full answers. In the question two, type numbers in letters, okay? Pay attention to the answer. What's a carnival? How long does it last? When is it? What's a samba? That's a, those are the questions. So play, pay attention to the audio, please. Page 52. Exercise 5. Listening. Carnival time. Part A. Mike has just returned from Brazil. Listen to him talk about carnival. What did he enjoy most about it? Isn't that music fantastic? It's from a samba CD that I got when I was in Rio for Carnival. Wow, Carnival in Rio is really something. It's a party that lasts for four whole days. It's held in late February or early March, but you need to book a hotel room way in advance because hotels fill up really quickly. Carnival is celebrated all over Brazil, but the most famous party is in Rio. The whole city is decorated with colored lights and streamers. It's really beautiful. Everyone is very friendly, especially to visitors from other countries. The best part about Carnival is the big parade. The costumes are unbelievable. People work on them for months. It's really fantastic to watch. Everyone dances the samba in the streets. I'd really recommend you go to Rio for Carnival if you ever have the chance. Page 52, Exercise 5, Part B. Listen again and answer these questions. Isn't that music fantastic? It's from a samba CD that I got when I was in Rio for Carnival. Wow, Carnival in Rio is really something. It's a party that lasts for four whole days. It's held in late February or early March, but you need to book a hotel room way in advance because hotels fill up really quickly. Carnival is celebrated all over Brazil, but the most famous party is in Rio. The whole city is decorated with colored lights and streamers. It's really beautiful. Everyone is very friendly, especially to visitors from other countries. The best part about Carnival is the big parade. The costumes are unbelievable. People work on them for months. It's really fantastic to watch. Everyone dances the samba in the streets. I'd really recommend you go to Rio for Carnival if you ever have the chance. All right, so what's a carnival? It's a party. It's a party, right? It's a party. Look, póngale así, ve. It is a party, ¿ok? No solo party, ¿ok? It is a party. ¿Qué pregunta aquí? ¿Cuánto tiempo dura? ¿Cuánto dura, verdad? ¿Ok? Last significa durar, ¿verdad? Last, así como el último. Ajá. Four days. The answer is no solo four days. Four all days. Escríbanme la respuesta, please. Let me see. How long does it last in the chat? It is, it is last four days. No, no, it is. No, it is. It, so it it's lasts, not four days. con la S, uh -huh. it lasts four days. Nadie me lo escribió. 
Vaya, así, con la S, dura, ¿verdad? Tercera persona ahí con la S, ¿ok? When is it? It is in February. February and March, right? It is, muy bien. Puede poner así, it is on late February or uh, early March. What is a samba? Dance. It's a dance. It's a dance, all right. Samba is the samba. It's a dance. Ahí están las respuestas. It is a party. No se lo va a poner a party, all right. Last. It's dura. Tiene que poner it lasts. Así con s. For four days. Así como lo dijo en el en el audio, ¿verdad? It lasts for four days. Dura por cuatro días. Así como lo ven acá. And samba is a dance. That's it. Si yo no le pongo de samba, vamos a ver si me lo agarra también. No. Póngale de samba. Ok. La samba es un baile. Y la respuesta acá, it's on late. ¿Ve? It's on late February or early March, ¿ok? Lo demás está fácil de contestar. Mm, it's a party, eh, it's a dance. Adverbial closest time will be introduced. I had a problem in my platform teacher in the, the number three. I wrote the same answers many times, mm -hmm. and I don't know why it ever showed me error or mistake. I really? Want to, I'm going to send you maybe tomorrow in an early morning. Number three? Yeah. I wrote the same answer like you. It is on late February. Yeah. Mm, did early you put March? a period? No, yeah. si, le puso period también. Yeah, everything. I wrote like Febra you. February, March lo puso con mayúscula. Yeah, that's right. Everything. Really? I want to send you tomorrow, maybe that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ahí lo puede mandar. Please send it in the group. Yeah. Because there is someone who is in charge of, the, of those situations. Uh, related with um uh, issues with platform it's very few what i can do is just to report but of oh. course thank you for letting me know it's not a mistake from your uh from your site but it's probably an error with the with the platform yeah, I since think you so. already Maybe. have the answer you know that it's in capital letter it is on late february exactly as the way that you just saw here so yeah that's weird right that's weird Anyways, guys, let's let's continue and uh, please send that information into the group. And so, ho I hope that somebody helps you with the uh, with that uh, inconvenient. Okay. Three point seven. Help me read. Who hasn't read today? Francisco, can you read? Of course. Okay. Um, in this lab, in this section, you will listen and practice a conversation about with wedding custom. Customs. Customs. A, al revés es, vea. Customs. Uh -huh. Customs. Customs. A verbial clause. Says. Clauses. A verbial clauses of time will be introduced. Introduced. Mm -hmm. Introduced. Thank you. Session. Session. Section es sección, este es sesión, ¿ok? Sesión, session. Conva, va, conversation. V, la V, conversation. All right. One more time, un poquito más rápido, come on. In this session, you will listen and practice session, a conversation about... Practice, uh, conversation about within custom, custom. A verbal clause of style will be introduced. Introduced. Very good. Introduced. Okay, introduced. Um, customs. 
son como las costumbres, ¿verdad? Las costumbres de, de cómo, de cómo, de algunas bodas. Ah, bodas, ajá. Ay. Hi, listen to the following conversation and find out how people in Japan celebrate their weddings. Pay attention to what they do before and after a ceremony. Listen and practice. Your wedding pictures are really beautiful, Emiko. Thank you. Those pictures were taken right after the ceremony. Where was the ceremony? At a shrine. When people get married in Japan, They sometimes have the ceremony at a shrine. That's interesting. Were there a lot of people there? Well, usually only family members and close friends go to the ceremony. But afterward, we had a reception with family and friends. So, what are receptions like in Japan? There's a big dinner, and after the food is served, the guests give speeches or sing songs. It sounds like fun. It really is. And then, Before the guests leave, the bride and groom give them presents. The guests get presents? Yes, and the guests give money to the bride and groom. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What did the bride and groom give each guest? I'm curious. What did you and your husband give everyone? Well, sugar is a symbol of happiness in Japan, so we gave each guest a ceramic box filled with sweets. What a nice custom. It sounds like it was a wonderful day. Oh, it really was. Okay, I know you couldn't see the um, the um the dialogue. So we're going to open it here. I hope that I can see it. I see him. There we have the celebrations, okay? Um, so, anniversary is a special location, a special location. Wedding is a special location. Activities is a, is dancing. What else? A parade, there are activities, a special food, toast, uh, roast turkey. What else? Champagne and things we give, cake. presents, flowers, a cake as well. Yeah, cake, thank you. Cake. Okay, yeah, you know how to form that. Did you know the next is uh, how? Um, well, we haven't read this, but the other is um, how much do you know about this month, guys? Halloween is a day when kids are, are in the United States. Verdad que ayer nos quedamos con una, una lectura pendiente, right? No, no leímos una parte. Era del Neighbors, algo así. En la section 2. Nos the, faltó end of, leer. The, end, the end of the section two. Yeah, exactly. We right. couldn't Entonces, complete because of the time. Because of the time. Yeah, I know. Over. Okay, but eso sí nos lo, lo vamos a hacer mañana. We will continue reading tomorrow. Okay, for now, um, we can just fill out this. How much do you know about these days and months? New Year's Day. Vamos a hacer este juntitos y con eso terminamos. Mañana uh, continuamos con, eh, con el listening y respondemos las preguntas de, de ese audio. Okay, so New Year's Eve. Víspera de Año Nuevo. It's a, it's a night when... People like to party. People like to party. Vale. Ok. Mm, so, let's see. One would be... 
April Fool's Day is a day when. ¿Qué decíamos? People play tricks on fans. Mm -hmm. Valentine's Day is a day when. Ya lo hicimos este. Ya. Yeah. Este Down. ya lo hicimos. Ok. But here, complete the sentences um, with the information of your own. Winter is a season when... When... Ahí ocupamos. So, winter is a season when it rains. It rains every day, almost every day. All right? Spring is a time of the year when... What? When the flowers appear. Yeah, good examples. Very well, guys. So we will listen to the audio tomorrow because um, this is the this is the audio. Okay, aquí está, aquí se ve mejor. Así que mañana lo terminamos. Eh, tenemos toda esta semana, verdad? Nos quedan tres días más para terminar la sección tres. So I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Um, thank you for being on time. Nos vemos mañana y gracias por conectarse. Bye bye. Take care. Good evening, guys. Night.